Queen Camilla is the wife of Charles III. Vilified in the media for her extramarital affair with Charles, she has been a constant companion for the king. Charming and strong-willed, Camilla has shown herself to be a confident woman with all the strength that a queen needs. Born Camilla Rosemary Shand, Queen Camilla was born on the 17th of July 1947 in London to Major Bruce Shand and the Honourable Rosalind Cubitt. She grew up in Sussex and she has one younger sister called Annabelle Elliot and she also had one younger brother named Mark. One of her great-grandmothers, Alice Keppel, was a mistress of Edward VII of the United Kingdom. Her mother volunteered at various charities and her father made various business ventures after retiring from the army. From a young age, Queen Camilla loved to read and ride horses. Her childhood was mostly happy. At the age of five, Camilla was sent to Drumbrells, a co-educational school, before attending Queen's Gate at the age of ten. She was bright, lively and confident, and was popular amongst the students. After completing one O level in 1964, she left to attend Montfortile Finishing School in Switzerland. After this, she studied French and French literature at the University of London Institute in Paris for six months. In 1965, Camilla was a debutante in London and soon shared a flat in Kensington with a friend. In her early adult years, she worked as a secretary in the West End and as a receptionist in Mayfair. In the early 1960s, Camilla met Andrew Parker Bowles and they had an on and off relationship for years. Eventually, they married on the 4th of July, 1973. Several members of the British royal family attended the wedding, including the Princess Royal, Queen Elizabeth II and Queen Elizabeth the Queen Mother. Camilla and Andrew made their home in Wiltshire and they had two children, Tom and Laura. Though her husband and children were Catholic, Camilla remained Anglican and did not convert. In 1995, the couple divorced. Camilla's mother, Rosaline, died in July 1994 from osteoporosis and accompanied with the end of her first marriage, that year was a particularly difficult time for Camilla. Camilla met the then Prince Charles, Prince of Wales, in 1971. Andrew and Camilla had already broken up and Andrew was dating Princess Anne. They met for the first time at the home of their friend Lucia Santa Cruz and became close friends. Their friendship developed into a romantic relationship and as their relationship became more serious, each introduced the other to their respective families. The relationship was put on hold while Charles was in the Navy, but it ended. Camilla did not wait for Charles, as she was not sure he would want to be with her once he left the Navy. The royal family had made it clear that Camilla was not seen as a suitable wife for a future king, and Charles had not made it clear to Camilla that her to wait. They stayed in contact, and by the mid-1980s, they were having an affair. Their affair became public knowledge in the press in 1992 with the publication of Diana Her True Story, a book about Charles's wife Diana. The media vilified Camilla because of this. Her reputation never truly recovered, but after marrying Charles in 2005 and after much PR improvement, her reputation has somewhat recovered. After Charles divorced Diana in 1996 and Diana's subsequent death in 1997, Charles and Camilla began a relationship, which was made official to the public in 1999. In February 2005, Charles and Camilla's engagement was announced. Charles gave Camilla a ring which had belonged to his grandmother, the Queen Mother. As both were divorced, the prospect of Charles marrying Camilla was seen as controversial. But they were given consent by the Queen, the government and the Church of England. 
They were wed on the 9th of April 2005 in a civil ceremony followed by a religious service of blessing. None of their parents attended a civil ceremony, but their parents did attend the service of blessing. Following their wedding, Camilla took the title of Duchess of Cornwall. Legally, she was the Princess of Wales. However, out of respect for Diana, the previous Princess of Wales, and Charles's first wife, Camilla took one of the feminine versions of Charles's subsidiary titles, the Duke of Cornwall. Camilla became a grandmother for the first time in 2007. She has five grandchildren, Lola, Eliza, Gus, Louis and Frederick. She is also a stepmother to Charles's children, William and Harry, and a step-grandmother to their children. Camilla has a number of interests and is a patron of several organisations, including Battersea Dogs and Cats Home, Maggie's Cancer Caring Centres and the London Chamber Orchestra. In 1994, Camilla became a member of the National Osteoporosis Society, following the death of her mother from the disease. Her grandmother had also died from the disease in 1986. In 2006, she launched the Big Bone Walk campaign, leading 90 children and people with osteoporosis for a 10-mile walk and climb around Loch Muuk in Scotland to raise money for the charity. It raised £200,000 and continues every year to this day. On the 1st of January 2022, Queen Elizabeth II made Camilla a Royal Lady of the Most Noble Order of the Garter. And a month later, the Queen made it clear that she wished for Camilla to be known as the Queen Consort. Upon her son ascending the throne, Camilla became the Queen Consort on the 8th of September 2022, following the death of Queen Elizabeth II. Her husband became known as Charles III. On the 10th of September 2022, Camilla attended the Proclamation Council of Charles III as a witness. For now, Camilla is known as the Queen Consort. This is to distinguish her from Queen Elizabeth II, who for over 70 years was known as the Queen. It is expected with time Camilla will be known as the Queen.